There's been 38 minutes of terror in Hawaii after an emergency alert warning of a missile attack was accidentally sent to everyone on the island. It sparked mass panic with tourists and locals running for their lives before a correction was sent out. Just after 8 in the morning in Hawaii, the sun was up and people were heading for the surf. But then came this terrifying official government warning and it sent them running. It was on everyone's mobile phone, on radio and breaking into TV programs. The US Pacific Command has detected a missile threat to Hawaii. A missile may impact on land or sea within minutes. This is not a drill. A doomsday scenario was apparently about to happen. This terrifying phone text warned, ballistic missile threat inbound to Hawaii. Seek immediate shelter. This is not a drill. In the 38 minutes it took to announce it was a false alarm, panic ran through the state. Australian tourist Jackie Kalisi reacted probably like most others at the time. And I was like, oh my gosh. So I started crying because I don't want to die. And I was, I was scared. And I was just thinking, you know, what has Hawaii done? Cam Redden was another Aussie on holidays in Waikiki. Children were screaming. One of the elderly people I was with was having a panic attack. It was a very long 38 minutes that felt a lot longer than what it actually was. The state governor said there was a simple but embarrassing explanation. You know, this uh, should not have happened. An employee pushed the wrong button. There's no doubt the tensions and the bad mouthing going on between President Trump and North Korean leader Kim Jong-un heightened beliefs that this could in fact be real. Trump, who was partway through his golf game at his golf club in Florida, was quickly alerted to the mistake. Robert Penfold, Nine News.